at any time during the surface creation, we can add contours to our surface. To do that, we can select the surface, the contextual ribbon will show up, and we can go to the far left-hand side where we can go to the Add Labels dropdown. If we just have one style, we can just go directly to what we want to label. So we can either do label, uh, single, multiple, or multiple at interval. Uh, the two most commonly used are single and multiple. If you have a large existing surface is where you'd want to use uh, multiple at interval. So in this case, I want to put them at each location individually. So I'm going to do contour single. If I just have one surface in the drawing, it's going to automatically select that one. And that's what it did here. So here I can click where I want the labels to go. And as I do that, it's going to put the label in the drawing. Once I'm happy with them, I can press Enter. Sometimes I want to label a whole bunch at the same time. So to do that, I can go back and do Contour Multiple. And with Contour Multiple, I'll be able to select one point and then select a second point. And anywhere in between those two points are going to be labeled. If I don't like the location of the labels, I can always select one of the contour labels, use one of the grips, and move it to a new location. If I want to get rid of the labels, I can just go ahead and select the label, contour label, and hit delete, and that'll remove it. So you can move the single ones as well. So if I don't like where they are, I can always move them. As long as the line crosses a contour, it'll show up. If I move it away, the contour line is still there, but the label won't be there. You can also drag it and make it longer and save yourself some time that way. Um, as you're viewing the contours, if I add another contour label for multiples, if I want to only label the majors, I can always go in and select the contour label line and go into the AutoCAD properties and control what is shown and what's not shown. So if I don't want to view the minor contours, I can always set the value from true to false, and then the minor contours go away. If I do regen, it will update, and now I've got my contour label set. And so this is how you can add contour labels to a civil 3D surface.